so I have a problem. Disaster. Disaster is about to strike and I can feel it. I've been sniffly all morning and my head hurts and I can feel it in my sinuses and I am not, I repeat, not going to allow myself to get sick. So I am off to the grocery store. I'm going to buy orange juice and sea packs and I'm gonna rest and take it relatively easy while still getting some work done and I'm gonna write and I'm not gonna get sick not gonna get sick it's not gonna happen I know it's that time of year I know it happens to me this time right around November always right before my birthday before something important or in the middle of something important like for example trying to write 50,000 words in the month of November so I'm not getting sick. It's not happening. Okay, so I totally skipped today, and for that, I'm sorry. Um, I totally forgot to update yesterday. I did not get a lot of writing done. I am only sitting at 23,687 words, and I should be at 25,000 as of this morning. Today is November 16th, and I just, I couldn't get any writing done yesterday. I mean, I did a little bit, obviously, but I have so much else going on. I'm trying to fight off this cold, which I'm doing a really good job of, by the way. <laughs> um, it has not progressed past like a little sniffle and throat itch, so hopefully it'll stay that way. But yeah, I just, writing-wise, not a lot happening. So I'm off to run errands this morning, and then... Hopefully I'll have some time today to kind of get caught back up. I feel like I'm on this giant roller coaster of falling behind and then getting caught back up, getting a little bit ahead, and then falling back behind again. So I'm going to try to break that cycle today. Um, we'll see how it goes. Okay, so it is still November 16th, and it's almost 8 o'clock at night, and... I'm struggling so hard. I, um, I've been trying to write all evening and I just can't. I'm at 23,930 words. I'm officially like a full day and a half behind on my writing and it's just not, it's not flowing. It's not happening. I don't know whether to push myself or just wait until tomorrow and see if waking up refreshed will help. I'm just not sure. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I haven't been this far behind yet and I'm scared. I'm scared that I'm gonna fall way too far behind and never be able to catch up. But at the same time, I'm sitting here staring at a page and I can't get words to go onto it, if that even makes sense. So I think I'm just gonna take a little break, maybe half an hour, and try to do something else for a little bit and come back to it. And if it doesn't flow at that point, I'm just gonna give up for tonight and go at it tomorrow. So wish me luck, I need it. That, my friends, is the sound of a clock. The clock ticking away on NaNoWriMo. It is, <laughs> it's Friday, November 18th, and I have not written a single word since the last time I updated. I'm actually still sitting at 23,900 and something. Um, I haven't even opened my notebook in the last day and a half. And, oh, hi puppy. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Say hello. Say hello to everybody. I know. Hi. <laughs> um, anyway, I haven't even opened my notebook in a couple of days and I'm feeling pretty down about it. I'm kind of in one of those funks where I feel like, here, I'm in really bad, bad light, bad light. Okay. Um. I'm feeling kind of down about it because I feel like I should be so much farther ahead and not like three days behind like I am now. I should have hit 
25k on the 15th and here we are on the 18th and I'm still at right around 24k so I'm struggling there's been a lot going on though um, some stuff I can't really talk about yet but I'm very very excited about and it's kind of been dominating my time so life happens is what I'm saying it happens to the best of us and we just got to roll with it so today I'm gonna roll with it hopefully I'll get some time to write in and at the very worst I'll just have a lot more to catch up on no worries I'm still determined 50k this month we're doing it all right it is day 20 I'm at 25,203 words still a lot of catching up to do unfortunately however I'm uh, pretty excited because this guy's back home and he's cooking me breakfast baby say hi what's going on hello <laughs> he's making me breakfast how awesome is that? I have a husband back. Um, that was the big exciting thing that I couldn't talk about was that um, my husband was coming home. He's been gone for six months and he's finally home and that makes me a very happy camper. So now I can concentrate and get back to my writing and hopefully, hopefully get all caught up this weekend. See how it goes. You and your deadly little tongue. <laughs> Get him, Bentley. Get him, Bentley. <laughs> Good morning. It is officially Monday, November 21st, and... I am finally gonna get a new vlog up on the channel today, so I'm very excited. Um, I haven't updated as much this week because I haven't written as much this week. And last night, I actually, actually all day yesterday, I did a lot of writing. Um, and I wrote, I wrote somewhere around 3,000 words. I'm now sitting at 28,000 and 34 words. So I'm very, very happy with how much I got caught up. I'm still not to where I should be. Um, as of today, I should be at 35,000 words by the end of the day. So I have a long way to go to catch up, but I'm hoping that this week, it's a little bit of an easier week for me work-wise. I'm hoping that this week is gonna allow me to get fully caught up and back on track. Um, having my husband home has been incredible and I'm so excited that I was finally able to talk about it. Um, it's one of those things due to operational security you're not really supposed to talk about um, deployments like where they're at when they're coming home and things like that so it's kind of something that um, had been on my mind a lot but I wasn't really able to talk about so I'm really excited that I'm finally able to scream from the rooftops that my husband is home and I'm so excited um, he's taking a couple of weeks off of work, so we're spending a lot of time together catching up, which is amazing. Um, but yeah, so that's where I'm at right now. My story is going really, really well. Um, hand cramps are not really a thing. I've been doing a lot of stretches, um, and so far my hand is holding up to the massive amounts of writing that I'm doing, so that's great. And I have a lot of stuff coming up this week. Um, both for YouTube and for the blog so a lot of stuff that I'm working on behind the scenes but for now for NaNoWriMo I'm happy we're doing well I'm way behind where I should be but I'm keeping it positive today and saying that I'm doing well because I got really really caught up yesterday and then hopefully today and tomorrow I'll be able to get back to an even playing field here so yeah that's my update I'll see y'all soon Bye.